Hello and welcome to a little extra thing for our rambling, well, 15 minutes this time, <laughs> where we will take a look at the game that I made for the game jam. Why, this is ominous. Yeah, well... Ooh, edgy! <laughs> that, and I, I figured that, you know, since it is a little bit of a horror game, I figured I might give a little content warning. <laughs> well, you're not exactly dead, you liar. Yeah, I'm, I'm still alive, but it, it's part of the meta narrative, you know. Well, I'm sorry if I accidentally break the game during this, but. Uh... Yeah, some people have reported a bug, so. Uh, and it's a game breaking one, unfortunately. So I hope that does not happen in this uh, run. So, yeah. What is this? Oh. This is uh, the research table. It says right on top of the screen research. Okay. Oh, it's on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> Can I... Oh. God damn it, we already got the bug. <laughs> yeah, restart the game. Okay. At least the record is nice and goes to black when I break it. Yeah. Boop. Made with Unity! Yeah, what else was I gonna make it with? Well, I guess I should just have done the <laughs> debugging and told you how I broke it. Well, but that's the problem. I know it, it just seems to break on that one. But so I... where am I supposed to click then? Here? Yeah, just... There ah, we go. Okay. Sometimes that just happens. Framework. I need to research frame. Needles. And tubes. Pipes. Okay. So. Get cooking. I need to research frame and I need to research inze injection. Okay. To the other side. Doof, doof, doof. So. I give some background while I'm figuring it out. <laughs> Yeah, so the team for the game jam was Love is Blind, and I had a little bit of a brainstorm uh, before starting with this, and I basically came up with the concept of a game that would explore the whole idea of uh, passion, which is a form of love, though not per se for a person, uh, basically consuming you to the point where it would actually become uh, a huge problem for yourself. And, I basically created the game around that idea, and well, uh, together with that, I uh, figured, hey, well, since I'm gonna go that way, it's kind of gonna be a spooky thing, I guess. So <laughs> let's try and emulate Silent Hill One <laughs> graphically, except for the menus. The menus are god awful, but well, the, we we looked it up. The menus in PlayStation games are just god awful in general. Yeah, I know, but there's like absolutely the zero. Uh, artistry behind these menus, unfortunately. So what else do I need? So now I need four needles. Yeah. One, two, three, four. There's a couple of things you didn't manage to do anyway. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there was... Uh, first of all, just the way that uh, technology gets added to the tech tree because every day you're gonna get uh, some new things to make and research. I'll try to play nice with the pacing, okay? <laughs> yeah, it's uh, a little bit uh, rudimentary, it just gets added on a daily basis, so... Considering a couple of things that happen in the game, it actually would have been better if there were like specific events that could trigger new stuff being added. Yeah, but you also made this in a week while still working during the day. Exactly. So, and this is it for today? Yeah. But do I need to do something here? Yeah, you need to... You Basically, you need to indeed go through the door to work on the project there once you've uh, made things. I just don't know what's there. And now you can sleep. Yeah, a lot of people actually read it as, um, as going outside. <laughs> it would have been nice if you had time to find like a better font. Yeah. But again, yeah. Also, just... another fun thing that you didn't manage to do mm -hmm. was make the make the vertices swim <laughs> like on a playstation yeah that was the thing i had been and thinking right. about for a bit to make a post-processing effect okay. to make a post-processing effect that would uh, kind of emulate the swimming geometry that you see with the old ps1 which actually i read up on and it has some it's a very interesting why that actually happens mm. um to tubes and two bikes it actually happens because for the PS1, in order to make things actually run somewhat smoothly, 
they actually rounded down vertex positions in the world to snap to pixel coordinates uh, when they would be projected onto the screen. And because of that, you know, vertices would just, you know, jitter a bit compared to their basic model position. Or as I describe it, swim. Yeah. And that's basically what happens there. And that's why when a camera is rotating around a model, even if it's something that completely stands still with no PS1, you get these weird little jitters where suddenly it looks like the part of it is growing and shrinking constantly. That, that's basically what happens there. It's a really cool effect, honestly. If you're trying to aim for this very lo-fi kind of look. Of course. <clears throat> but I didn't get to it. I also wanted to add like TV static and such to it, but uh, <laughs> to nope. allow you to reach the difficult spots. Mm, suggestive. <laughs> well, is it suggestive or is it? Uh, well, yeah, is it suggestive? That's <laughs> basically well. <laughs> okay. I think I did it right. Yeah, you can go to bed. Really? Yeah. It's, oh, okay. it's 12 a.m. I basically just added the whole sleeping mechanic to make time run faster forward in case you would actually be done with... Oh, uh... your music is kicking in. Ah, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's day three now, so day three shit starts uh, to go down. Oh. Yeah, oh. you might notice a couple of little spots on the, <laughs> on the floor. I'm not sure if I'm comfortable anymore. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, research batteries. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> so research the batteries first. Yeah, that's. Uh, but what do I need for the batteries? Yeah, take a look there. I think it has something to do with your potting breaking, actually. Uh, yeah, it's it's obviously it's something like that, but I don't know what's causing it to break. That's the problem. It might actually be the collision mesh. Thinking. That's possible. So two screws. Yeah. And two tubes. No wires? No. Okay. See, even I am kind of like <laughs> starting to forget like what did and did you not need for certain components. I know it's uh, uh, if you're really optimal about things, you can actually hurry up uh, work so quickly that you actually really need sleep to be a mechanic so you can just skip forwards. Yeah, I kind of don't want to go into the menus anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now I need two wires in the tube. So yeah, the music was composed in like half a day. I've never done music before or audio. I had to record. I had to record all the uh, sound effects. So the footsteps, for example, are me actually putting my mouse mat on a wooden table and then dropping my search hand and then dropping my phone on it and uh, for the crafting sounds I basically just like scraped a fork on a uh, on a uh, pan lid since we have these nice metal pan lids uh, that sort of stuff I you know clapped a little bit, uh, hit myself with my hand to get these uh, low noises and such. And then I just, you know, edited it to hell and back. Not, not really knowing what I was doing. But, yeah. It was fun. Make two screws. Okay. There we go. I, uh, I actually get uncomfortable playing this. This is why I don't play horror games, because I just automatically panic. <laughs> and, and I know there's no real danger. Uh-oh. I did something wrong. Can I do the hand now? Uh-oh. I need a battery again? Yeah. Don't worry, I gave you quite some time, honestly, yeah. after... You need some more. You need uh, tubes, one. Yeah. need a battery. How am I doing this with one hand? Don't think about that. <laughs> Screws. Pipe. And a needle. 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 No tubes. Oh, tube. <laughs> you hardly remember it yourself. Yeah. 
Yay! No! I died. You died. <laughs> I actually <laughs> never seen someone dying so far. <laughs> okay. okay. Do I just start again? Yeah, sure. You do I now? Try? Do I now break the thingy of the hand stuff? Or do you no? But you can just prepare for it. What do you mean? Just make the battery in advance. Ah, but uh, then I needed to make two batteries ahead of time. Yeah. Well, I didn't do that. <laughs> Research that. It's uh, it's good to know that you can actually run out of time there still because I was kind of sure that if you would just you know quickly do everything you had more than enough. Well, time. the problem is I'm very forgetful and we're also talking over it. Yeah, true. And I had to go back check what it was again a lot of the time. Yeah. What was it again? Two, two tubes. tubes. No. Uh, two no needles. needles. Yes. Beep. So yeah. So yeah, I broke it immediately. <laughs> no, you didn't break it because I did. I mean, that's just a fail state. Yeah, but I also broke it immediately. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, with the with the bug, but yeah. again, that's just it. Sometimes happens, and I'm not sure if it only happens with that crafting table or with other tables as well. I think it's related to me having clicked too much. No, because I basically ignore all input until the character is standing still. Mm. I did that on purpose to kind of emulate the the tank controls ID, mm. even though you know. No, that's not really what tank controls are. Yeah, indeed, and it doesn't really communicate, and people seem to really not like it. But eh, my well. game was not made for you to like. <laughs> <laughs> listen, to mi listen to Mr. Artist over here. <laughs> Hey, I did a couple of concessions. For example, the crafting menu actually shows how much you have of each thing. Mm -hmm. I realized that would be really necessary to that. So. Yeah. At, at least I know if, if I have enough of a thing. Yeah. And it was easier than making an inventory menu, which you had to then toggle mm -hmm. yourself. Paper. So, yeah. Nap naps. Yeah. <laughs> That's a little more on the schedule. Yeah. At 2 a.m. It is kind of balanced that as the game progresses, you will have less and less time to actually go and sleep. Yeah. Yeah. Which, uh, I will admit, was just a happy accident. But it really fits the team, in my opinion. Wait, I don't want to research this. No, researching is fine. <sighs> Panic! <laughs> it's only when you make it. You okay. can even see it. Unfortunately, I spoiled uh, the surprise there. Yeah. Two tubes and two pipes. Two tubes and pipes. Doop, 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 doop. I almost thought I broke it again. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The, me the menu seems to take a little bit of time to get up, so sometimes I do also think that it's about to break. Now I ruined the pacing of this by dying. Ugh. Nah. It's probably also because I went to check your other effect while, uh, while I was doing the hand thing, you know? Oh yeah, yeah. the, the sound effect kind of needs, uh, should clue you in, but on the other hand, the UI blocks the effect, so... Yeah, so you saw it at least. Yeah. <laughs> sure. It's kind of silly because I made crafting animations and such as well, and now you can't see them. <laughs> well... I should have thought of that. <laughs> <laughs> well, now it's too late. <laughs> yeah. You, you said you didn't want, want to polish this any at all, uh, more at all, which I can get. No, I... Uh, it's a quick throwaway project. At the beginning of the week, I was really happy with how the project was going. And Wait, really I now can sleep, right? enthusiastic about it, but... Uh, by the end of the game, I was like, okay, I'm really happy that I finished it, but uh, this is the end. <laughs> <laughs> Uh-oh. Panic. Ooh, spooky <laughs> noise. What did I have to do again? Batteries. Research batteries. And make two batteries. Yeah. Maybe I'll just make the whole prosthetic hand thing immediately. But then you don't get the rush, honey. <laughs> Oh, screws two screws and two tubes. And don't forget to research the hand as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that would suck. Was the hand for free? Yeah. 
The hand is for free. You're basically just looking at your own hand. <laughs> hmm, how does my own hand work? <laughs> <laughs> So how did you do the music? Because I remember you had a whole explanation for it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> poke, so, poke, poke. <laughs> so basically, I looked for some free composing software. Mm -hmm. And I found one called LMMS, which uh, I loaded up and looked up uh, on some uh, uh, quick tutorials on how to get started with it. And uh, it's... Basically just, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's a whole timeline sequencer with uh, both generators for uh, uh, for noises as well as, um, uh, as uh, sampling tools. And so I first tried something with the generators, but I couldn't really get anything out of it. But then I did find a shallow sample that came with the program. Mm -hmm. And that was... Um, that was uh, that would, uh, turned out to be you know pretty good if you just tuned it down a whole lot. Uh, if you tuned it down a whole lot, you actually got this really creepy sound that uh, I I described it as um, uh, hearing uh, the Titanic run over ice. <laughs> That's that really nice creaking, uh, terrible sound to it, and oh. Did I break it again? Yep, but this is a bug that I haven't seen before. Great! Do you want to play it now? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? <laughs> okay, so we broke it a couple of times. Do you want to take over? Because then it's going to be quicker. Because I need to figure everything out. Okay. So we're going to do quick switcheroozies. Yeah. And I'm going to relaunch it. I have not seen that bug yet. God damn it. <laughs> it's fine. It happens. Like yeah. we said, it's made in a week. You're not gonna find every bug in a week. Yeah, but on the Even other hand, the systems are pretty small, so... I don't know if I have to be happy or sad that this is the first time I've seen that bug. <laughs> <laughs> so, course. first of all, we need six of these. Six? In total. <laughs> of course. He's going to straight up cheat. He's not even going to look at I'm it. I'm going to speed run it. <laughs> <laughs> mm, I love you, honey. I love you, too. <sighs> keep on crafting. Keep on crafting. The hope is that if you play it, we're not going to break it. <laughs> yeah, well. I, I, I keep stumbling into bugs. I don't know what it is, man. <laughs> this game is unfortunately just barely held together. So you bugs happen randomly. You made it with duct randomly. tape and styrofoam? Yeah, <laughs> in seven days. So, well. also a little detail because I felt like being uh, cute mm -hmm. is uh, that the time span that the game takes place in is the same time span that the game jam was uh, taking place in. Ah, uh, how adorable! <laughs> <laughs> so there, there was like one guy uh, who participated in the game jam who took it upon himself to stream every single game that was made during the jam, which is like over 300 games, I think 333. Which was is a, very a little nice, nuts. Which was a very nice number, honestly. So 333 games were made, and he apparently played every single one of them, and he caught up on that uh, thing, and he was like, may, uh, having the whole expectation that this was going to be about, oh, so you're making a game, and then he like, <laughs> saw what we were doing and it's like, this is not a game. <laughs> I'm gonna say what you're making, making a shogot. <laughs> okay. I basically didn't want to tell what you're making because I know. horror is so much more effective if you don't know what's going on or like what the monster or whatever is. Or you're making yourself a wonderful sex doll. Too bad you cut your hand off for it. <laughs> oh, the hand is the first part only. <laughs> Hey, the joke you're spoiling is, your own game! <laughs> yeah. The thing is, the hand is an accident. Well, implied accident, because you make it uh, lose well, it while making a sock end. cutter. <laughs> but, uh, I'm gonna stop you right there. Yeah. Wait, I need more needles, I think. I'm gonna need more in the future anyway. And they take no time to make, so... Eh. Of course. Chip, 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 chip. 
There's also another problem in that like the critical components, you can actually make them multiple times, even though that's not the intention. <laughs> I never put down flags to say like, yeah, okay, it's made already, disable it. Yeah. It's only getting enabled and disabled depending on where you have all the necessary components for it. Which, funnily enough, does make the parts that you need to lose body parts for, does make them one make only. Really? Yep, because I actually, at the beginning of the game, mm. I add your body parts to your inventory. <laughs> I'm carrying a hand and whatever else we're gonna lose. <laughs> I mean, honestly, it's a very simple and kind of elegant solution, especially if you don't have an inventory window. Yeah, I can imagine. I just find it funny that, that that one guy who streamed it thought he, you were going out for work or something with that. Yeah, people seem to really understand that uh, walking through the door is going out. Which, uh, yeah, that was not really the intention, so I probably should have uh, Maybe put hinted. a sign on their construction room. <laughs> yeah, or just hinted that there was something. Oh yeah, batteries. What did research need again? Wire. Well, you need a wire to make it. But I don't remember what the research needed. I'm See, I'm massively forgetful. I did it twice. <laughs> yeah. But again, I don't remember it properly either. Ah, goddammit, screws. I forgot well, you screws. can in the meantime research your own hand. Yeah. Yeah, I also constantly went back and forth on the speed up time for... Uh, screws. Yeah. For uh, work and research. It's like... The very simple stuff that doesn't get sped up at all, but as soon as things take an hour or more to make, I did speed up the time because otherwise you'd be sitting there with the very early things already sitting there 20 real-time seconds to get a simple thing done. And it's like, wait, I have a couple of these that take quote-unquote eight hours to make. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Not gonna make people... Uh, wait for that long? Wait for like two minutes to make something. Two tubes? Yeah. I'm not gonna wait for that to happen. Create two batteries. Make the saw. <laughs> yeah. Create. Look, it's the hand <laughs> in yes. the requirements. <laughs> yes, exactly. It's a bit of a spoiler, but yeah. On the other hand, <laughs> hand. Uh, <laughs> if you don't get that information, I doubt you have any clue what the hell is going on. Tube. It wasn't very clear I was nearing the end of my uh, allotted time for it as well. But there isn't really a lot of time. So now he has like some blood on his pants and on his fingers. <laughs> I actually had fun doing that as well. Great. Doing uh, those little... It's not the last time uh, you'll see wounds on him. Uh oh. <laughs> Yeah, this is, this is only gonna get worse. <laughs> I kind of wish I could have made the music even like more terrible uh, as time went on, but yeah. Two wires, two tubes, and tw do that twice. So, two yeah. wires and four tubes. No, no, four wires and two tubes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We're gonna need more batteries anyway, so... <laughs> Full of batteries. Yeah, yeah. So once it's finished, are you just gonna spend all your time replacing everything? Uh, replacing what you mean? The batteries! Oh. Because <laughs> now you need to do some research first as well for the motor systems. And I don't... I think it was eight screws for this. Yeah. And a couple of tubes and pipes. Yeah, you wouldn't know them because the... The research is only just unlocked. Mm -hmm. Of course, because I died and I broke the game. <laughs> yeah. uh, I'm not surprised I just stumbled it first into like bugs. I, I don't know what I have, but uh, I seem to have this uh, click too much thing that breaks half the games out mm, there. Maybe. I guess my game might the, not be The free. only people worse is like actual QA people. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this game wouldn't stand for a minute to those people. Did I break it? <laughs> I tried my very best to make sure that clicks would not do anything while you're crafting, but mm. uh, you never know what happens. Yeah, maybe like on the interval between going away and being done with uh, crafting. Ugh. 
like I said, I don't want I don't want to look at the UI. <laughs> Out of the UI, you mean? <laughs> no, every time I look at the UI, I look back. It's it's worse. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, this is one of the longer ones. Okay. To make. No, I'm actually running a bit behind. Are you? Yeah, it's one a.m. So we can't sleep anymore this time. You still can, but uh, it's not that advised. Another battery. Two wires? Oh, it probably costs a, a battery to research, I yeah. guess. So now we're already on the next part, but... Okay, so we can just continue with the next part. In the meeting. Yeah. It Again, this is like... At, uh, in the end, you will lose out on sleep with this game. Mm. Well, in game, you will lose out on sleep. And but there, is there a downside to it in this game? No, but I do think that narratively it actually fits very well. Yeah. But sleep is literally only there to make time go faster. Okay. It doesn't do anything else. Which you kind of want at the beginning. Yeah, but... Uh, so I guess you need to be prepared for the worst shit again. Optic yeah. systems... Let's research that first. Did so why, why is the room One battery, changing? one screw and one wire. One screw and wire and battery. One screw and wire and battery. Yeah. One screw and wire and battery. Screw. We need then three wires because we need one for the two for the batteries as well. Mm -hmm. Does that mean we're going to catch up now? Uh. If we didn't sleep, I mean. We can sort of catch up. Because okay. these aren't that long to make. It's mostly, you know, just... Ah, oh, come on. Tubes. <laughs> tubes. Forgot a tube. Okay. Well, you used up a tube. Oh, yeah. Made one too little then. There we go. We'll get there. Don't worry. Yay. Excitement. During playtests, I still made mistakes and I still made it. So, okay. yeah, it's doable. You're also talking to me, which is a massive distraction. Yeah, that's true. And as to why the room uh, gets uh, dirty and dirtier, I thought it would be cool. Basically. And it's <laughs> also there to really clue you in that things are going wrong. Another battery. And this one, no, that one only needed screws. So two wires, a tube. Make the screws already. Yeah, I guess. that was the plan. I'm waiting with bated breath. <laughs> Which character was I in Warcraft? <laughs> I don't know. I think it was like a siren char character. Sounds like something a siren would say. Oh, I think it was like in the... <laughs> and there we go, that's wound number two. So, oh, emergency no. care. Are we fine? No, we're fine. If you don't see the nasty visual effect, then we're fine. Well, did you actually make the eye? Hmm? Yeah, we made the eye. There we go. So, okay. Now we look a little worse. Oh. <laughs> yep. Sure. Then, right. Intelligence. Yeah, we just need to research intelligence for that. No batteries today. Normally oh, speaking. so we're researching AI in four hours. Yes, because that's how that works. <laughs> <laughs> that's how that works. <laughs> totally. Yeah. Did you know that AI can sort of happen by accident as well? Okay. Uh, I've heard a great story of like a little robot that uh, like got battery power from a light, mm -hmm. and as soon as it's uh, uh, for some reason because mm -hmm. uh, its battery power would go low, its re sensation of light would go away. So it would go to the spot to recharge its batteries automatically, oh. due to how it was programmed. Huh. Okay, that's interesting. So yeah, and that's wound number three. There goes half your brain. Yep. So quickly. H how fix are that. you still working? Uh, it's hurted though. 
keep telling yourself that. Yeah, I, I, had, a, I had a little bit of fun with the uh, item and research descriptions, <laughs> channeling a little bit of cynicism. Is so the next bit's not available. Yeah. <laughs> sleep it off. Sure, sleep it off. That's easy. Okay. There we go. Last day. That's research. The heart. Oh. And this one already costs you your heart, so... So you just put your heart right away in the room? Yep. Well, first we research it and then we make a heart. But the heart is not for you. But this already costs your heart. Yeah. So you already took your heart out for research and then you're gonna make another heart. <sighs> so there we go. So you end the game <laughs> like this. <laughs> Looking pale as fuck with my crummy, quickly made post-processing effect on it. And there we go. Well, that's charming. Yeah. And that's how the game ends. <laughs> so, are you at least a little proud of this? A little bit. It's it's more of like, hey, look, I actually managed to make a 3D game in seven days with a working crafting system. That's bug that we just discovered. <laughs> I did sound and music, which I've never done before. And a couple of people, well, and you obviously here are visibly disturbed by it, which hey, any good horror game should do, so... Well, I'm, I'm easily disturbed. We've already come to that conclusion. Okay, sure, but still, there is... Uh, there is... Uh, so there you go. You're now not you the saw it one. for yourself, and uh, if you want to just give it a try, go ahead. <laughs> yep. The uh, link we'll put the link in the description again. Yeah. It's already in one of the System Shock videos, but... Exactly. And then, well, see you next time where we will continue as usual. Bye-bye.